This is unexpected. Well, you never got to go on a honeymoon, so... We made you dinner! It's a luau! We got pineapples and coconuts and ukuleles! Oh, yay! yay. Hey, Yamarachika Tika, hee-ha! Hey, Yamarachika Tika, hee-ha! Ow, 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 Welcome to Latin America. Thank you. <laughs> you are an actress, you are a, a um, dancer in Happy, another video <laughs> clips from Pharrell Williams, and now a voiceover too, bueno, <laughs> uh, in, in the rec recent years, a voiceover too. Uh, let's talk about this experience for you like, as a voiceover. Um, it's so much fun. Like, you go in, you could be in your pajamas. You don't have to, like, worry about anything. You're just, like, in a little booth, and you get to imagine this crazy world. And um, you can, like, scream or, like, do whatever you want with the lines and just, like, try a bunch of different things. It's, it's really fun. Did you have interaction with the other actors? Um, well, I know Steve um, Carell um, well just from doing the promotion for the three movie for the different movies. But um, we actually don't record together. Like, um, we all record separately. So um, I've met everybody in the movie, but we didn't actually record together. What do you think about Drew? I think that he's hilarious. Like, I, I think one of my favorite parts of the movie is actually when um, they go to try to um, pull off a heist and, like... What Drew does is just like horrible. Like he's just like not cut out for, he's not heist material. Um, and I thought he was really funny, like with his long hair. He's just like, he's into the gadgets and stuff, but not so much like good at actually like getting the job done. Um, but I really like him. He's like a sweet character. Okay. Margo always puts family first. And that's a very good advice. Yeah, definitely. I mean, I think um, with the first movie, all she really has are her two sisters, and she's kind of like their mom in a way, because she's really protective of them. And then it's really nice to see over the course of the films, like Gru, how Gru becomes their dad, and like she really like starts to trust him. And then in this movie, how she's really getting used to having a mom for the first time with with Lucy. Um, but yeah, definitely, I would say it makes sense why she is so into family because for such a long time she didn't have a family, and now she has one. Yes. Uh, Margot initially uh, feels embarrassed and frustrated with her new mom. What do you think about this super mom? Um, I think that she's awesome. Like, if I had Kristen Wiig like, as a mom like figure, that's, like, really cool. But, um, yeah, I definitely understand Margot's, like, like, her being a little, like, tentative about it because she's just getting used to, like, her family with Gru, and then all of a sudden a new person's coming in. But, um, but yeah, I definitely think Lucy really proves herself in the movie and like she's like an amazing mom. Okay, let's talk about next projects. What is your next project now? Well, right now I'm actually just going to school, the USC. So I'm going to graduate in the next year. Um, so that's going to be cool to graduate. <laughs> so I'm just trying to get that done. Okay, good luck. Thank you. Thank you. Congratulations. Thank you. It was nice to see you. <laughs> so sweet talker. This place is amazing. It's nice, I guess. Sure. I'm not really into things. Uh -huh.